I would love to say it's great to be back here in Maryland, but then I'd be a lying piece of shit. That's already been established. Yeah, well established. Speaking of, hey everybody, look, it's Wardlow. Shut your mouths. Wardlow, I'm not staying out here because I can't stand to look at these disgusting pigs for one more second. I'm gonna watch the match in the back. But you should be terrified of the man who's about to come through that curtain. A man who is seven feet of sheer, unadulterated power. A man who's never taken an L in his life. Ladies and gentlemen, the Big Dub, William Morrissey. William Morrissey, all the way from Impact Wrestling. One of the stars of Impact Wrestling here as MJF's mercenary. The seven footer. Look at the size of him. My God. Look at the business man's in. He's young too. Great high school athlete, Arch Archbishop of Malloy High School. Great coach Jack Carter with a great coach of all time. Yeah, I tell you, Archbishop Malloy has had some great athletes come out of that school. Kenny Smith, our colleague here on yeah, the Turner. And of course, uh, our other colleague, Raphael Morphy, was an outstanding all star baseball player. So, there ties in, tie in here. You saw it at the bottom of the screen. This will be Wardlow's largest opponent ever and perhaps Wardlow's largest test ever as well. Let's look at this thing realistically. Uh, w. Morrissey has got to somehow relaunch whatever phase his career he chooses to throw. And how do you do that any better than coming on national television on a live forum and whipping somebody's ass that's as impressive as Wardlow? Wardlow has been hot, and there's there the coach, is, JR. Our coach. John Harbaugh, big wrestling fan. He was Brian Pillman's college roommate in Miami of Ohio. We mentioned that earlier. Really enjoyed talking to Coach Harbaugh before he went on the air tonight. Many of his players here, including Ben Cleveland, former Georgia Bulldog, is on the offensive line of the Ravens. He's a large man. He really is. It's great to see uh, Coach Harbaugh here. Yeah. You can join us next week for AEW's return to New York, the UBS Arena on Long Island, Wednesday, May 11th, and we'll also be returning to Houston, Texas, one week later, Wednesday, May 18th, at the Fertitta Center. Tickets for both events on sale right now, AEWTIX.com. The Fertitta Center is a fun place. We have a lot of friends coming. I think Brian Bosler may show up and watch this perform. Kong elbow tie up. Morrissey is trying to back Wardlow up to the corner, but Wardlow was able to slip under. Just don't expect this to be a fuck Briscoe type scenario. At some point, somebody's going to rear back and just start trying to beat the hell out of the other. Just as if on QJR Wardlow, Muscle and Morrissey up to the the corner. Two big, big men. It's hard to really identify how big they are. Our world champion Hangman Adam Page coming up next, and he's got a busy. How does he ever? Oh, oh, look at the sledgehammer blows It'll here be, from Morrissey. It'll be Hangman Adam Page defending the AEW World Championship against CM Punk, the main event of Double or Nothing, coming up later this month, live on pay per view. That'll be quite the show from Las Vegas. Tickets are moving very well. Morrissey sends Wardlow into the corner of the splash, but Wardlow immediately comes out with the shot in the midsection. Wardlow able to follow up very quickly. Catching uh, Morrissey a little bit off guard. That was smart wrestling to follow the big man in. Morrissey leapfrog. Tremendous agility on the big seven footer. And Morrissey's looking great here. He's feeling good. I wonder if Morrissey's approaching this as a simply a payday or a job interview. Wardlow to the outside. Morrissey. Remains in the ring. This could be a mistake to allow Wardlow a chance, any chance to recover. <laughs> Those strikes, forearm strike, and that fifth fist, those are with a 40. This guy's a hell of a striker. Wardlow throwing some hands on the floor, though. Wardlow, no Morrissey. Versus Wardlow goes face. 
face first into the ring post. Wow. Man, if that didn't mess him over, he's lucky. Morrissey's getting taken out of his game with a sellout crowd here tonight. Yeah, that's a good call. You might want to get back where you take care of your business, though. Yeah, it, it sounds like he's worried more about what the fans have to say than he is his opponent here, which, if your opponent's Wardlow, it's a mistake. What? Although it's a mistake anytime. Bro. We've seen how Wardlow is able to manhandle the butcher, the murderhawk monster, Lance Archer. Morrissey could have some of that in his future if he underestimates Wardlow. being manhandled like we've uh, not seen recently. This is a big, impressive young man. I mean, you know who else is big? Murderhawk monster Lance Archer and Wardlow able to powerbomb Archer four consecutive times. The fourth one was something else, man. Well, it worked because we're all talking about it. Right hand off the knees from Wardlow as he rises to his feet. Ooh! You don't want a guy like Wardlow reestablishing his vertical base. That's what was happening here just a moment ago. Swinging a miss by Morris. See oh. boss man slam. One, two, oh. no. I don't know how he got out of that, guys. That was a hell of a move. Boss man slam. Man, what a history and heritage that move had. Oh, God bless the boss man, buddy. Wardlow again finding himself on the mat. With Morrissey standing over him. Yeah. Uh, Wardlow's not been able to establish any su the sustained offense at all. Yeah. And that's a testament to the skills oh. and the abilities of uh, W. Morrissey. It could also be a testament to just how rough the past few weeks have been for Wardlow against, yeah. against MJF's hitmen. Yeah. Look at the size of Wardlow's fist. This is going to be a tremendous crash if they both, well, didn't happen. I thought if they were going to throw each other off, it was going to be with a. Wardlow! Off the top, and he landed on his feet! I don't think we talk enough about the agility of Wardlow, how he can move in the ring. We just talk about his strength, his power. And that had to be the last thing that Morrissey was expecting. Here we go! The big man. Getting in possession. He's got it. Oh my God! Power bomb in the seven footer. And that's it. There is your winner. It took one. It took one. But how impressive was that one?